Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am in here somewhere, of course wearing my Victoria's Secret pink. And today I thought it would be fun to actually put Juicy Couture Soiree, which is right here, put that right up against my Juicy Couture Glacé. And if you are a Juicy Couture fan, which you probably are if you're watching this, as you can tell, the ribbons are missing from both of my bottles. And that is not by accident. I love ribbons in my hair and I took both of them out to put ponytails in my hair and I just have not put the bows back on. But a girl loves bows. And another cute thing I did, which you girls can do at home, is this is the soiree pendant that is on the perfume bottle. I don't know if you can see that good enough, but it's really cute. It's pink and white and crystals. It's a masquerade mask. And that comes on this guy right here on the bottle with a bow. And I took it off and I put it on my gold necklace and it's absolutely stunning. I really, really love it. But back to my review. So I wanted to compare them both and tell you which one I like better, which might be hard for me to do, and what the difference is in both of these fragrances. Let's start with uh, Juicy Couture Soiree. Juicy Couture Soiree, let me talk right. And on Fragrantica, that is listed as a fruity, green, fresh, tropical, citrus, and white floral in that order. And honestly, I, I don't get tropical with this fragrance. I don't. I, I get warm. I do get a slight green and I am not a green person in fragrances at all, but the slight green I get in this, I can deal with. I definitely get very fruity, and I definitely get fresh, and I definitely get citrus, and a little bit of floral is thrown in there as well. Now, if you take this one over here, which is the Glacé, this one, it's hard to compare them with my words here, but let me try again. This one is not as fruity as this one. This one, Soiree is very fruity, whereas Glacé to me is just a straight up powdered sugar, sweetness in your mouth, uh, just picture powdered sugar and some maybe some vanilla and it's just so warm and sweet, whereas Soiree, definitely has a sharpness to it, which I do not like sharpness in perfume, but for some reason, I really gravitate towards Soiree. There's, it's not like a hard sharpness, it's just, it must be the green note, where it just, there's a little bit of sharpness there, but then it's balanced out with fruits and just refreshing. I actually saw a video where a YouTube person said to put this in the refrigerator, this soiree, and then spray it on, and it just has a cool, it has a coolness about it. It's just, it's a very refreshing summer perfume. So if you like slight florals and very fruity and a little green, you will not go wrong with soiree. Um, my sister smelled it once and said that I smell like Christmas morning, which I guess is a really good thing. <laughs> It's like a sweet, yummy, dare I say, there is a slight mint in this perfume. Call me crazy, I haven't read it in a review, but I, there's something else in this perfume that's not listed on Fragrantica. Um, let me just quick say, because I didn't tell you, the top notes in Soiree are kiwi and mandarin. So that's the fruit, and then there's jasmine, which is the floral, and a water lily and musk and amber. I, and it says woody notes. I don't get woody notes in Soiree. I get, I do get amber. I get a little bit of the Viva La Juicy um, DNA in this perfume, definitely. A little bit, and then if you wanna add in a little bit of a fresh, girly shampoo, I hate to say that, but I've read reviews and I agree. It's like if you just get out of the shower and it's a fruity, sweet, yummy, slightly floral fragrance. It's very girly. So let's move over to this guy, which 
I have to say this bottle, Glace, I love a lot more than Soiree. Soiree, I indulged and got a 3.4 ounce, which I've never got a perfume that big, and it's very gorgeous. I got the 1.7 of the Glace, and this bottle, if I could just, I'm scared to touch it because I'm scared it's going to fall off my little stand, but it has the most gorgeous pink sheen. It's like, it reminds me of like, snowfall with a with a pink sunset that's just glistening in the background it's absolutely stunning and as you can see there's enamel where the juicy couture logo is like that's pale pink and gold my absolute i might have to say my favorite bottle out of the juicy line and the pink bunny fur little ribbon which you don't see here but trust me it is stunning and let me go ahead and show you the picture of that on my Fragrantica, just so you can see what it would look like, if you can see that. Sorry, I'm trying to squeeze that in, but it's it's a beautiful presentation. And the main accords for Glace right here would be sweet, white floral, fruity, vanilla, and citrus, in that order. It says that it came out in 2017, and it features top notes of frozen mandarin, and pear sorbet, and the heart includes jasmine, orange blossom, and warm vanilla, and amber, and sandalwood. Um, like I said, with glace, I, I do get a slight floral, but it's it's very soft. It's, it's not sharp like my soiree. It's a soft, soft, very subtle floral, white floral, and I honestly, I don't get pear sorbet or orange in this glace or mandarin. I just get vanilla, powdered sugar, and a slight white flower. It's gorgeous if you like sweets, if you like gourmands, if you like to smell like a cupcake, if you want to smell like powdered sugar and vanilla and you just want to smell yummy, then pick glace over soiree. Soiree is like fresh and fruity just out of the shower with some flour. But if you want to just smell like straight up dessert and just smell very soft, warm, and cozy sweet, then get your hands on Viva La Juicy Glace in the beautiful, iridescent, snowy, beautiful bottle. And yeah, I guess that wraps things up. <laughs> if you want to have a fruity fragrance, that's a little bit sharp with some amber pink soiree. If you want to be a powdered sugar princess of cozy candy sweetness, then pick your glace. And I hope you like my review. And I'm going to do a review probably coming up tomorrow with a Forever 21 haul. I got a couple cute little fashion clothing items that I'm excited to show you guys and maybe model and you guys can see them and pick up some for yourself. And Thanks for tuning in. I love you guys, and I'll see you tomorrow.